From rumors of him contracting an incurable disease to questions about the future of Blue Bloods, here's why Tom Selleck fans are scared. Remember that suave detective all of us drooled over in Magnum P.I.? Or the guy who made us envy Monica with his role as Richard Burke in Friends? Well, rumor is he's in the middle of a serious health crisis. According to reports, Selex contracted some mysterious incurable disease, and his health is in pretty bad shape. As you can imagine, this news had his fans on the edge of their seats. I mean, it's never easy to hear that your favorite celeb is facing health issues, and given the fact that Selleck is almost 80, this sort of stuff can be super worrying. The whole thing actually started back in February 2019 when the National Enquirer dropped a bombshell claiming that Selleck was grappling with an incurable illness while filming Blue Bloods. According to the Enquirer, the situation was so bad that the show had to bring in a stunt double to save the day, which might seem pretty standard, especially for an action-packed show like Blue Bloods. The thing is, while many actors rely on skilled stunt doubles to take the risks, Selleck is part of a rare breed who prefers to do most of his own stunts. But looks like this commitment to authenticity hasn't come without a price. In an interview with CBS, Selleck opened up about the toll these daring feats have taken on his body. He shared, My back's kinda messed up. This is no surprise considering the rigorous demands of performing stunts and the strain of long periods of sitting around on set. But hold on, the plot thickens. About a year after these rumors were started, in January 2021, the Enquirer struck again with even juicier details. This time, they suggested that Selleck was battling crippling arthritis and was resorting to steroids to ease the pain and keep him on his feet. Not only that, but they threw in a wild card, his alleged loss of vision. On top of that, OK Magazine jumped onto the story. In February 2021, they spilled the tea, claiming that Selleck faced breathing troubles on set and needed frequent breaks between filming to recharge. Fans started coming up with wild theories. Some thought the demands of the show were taking their toll on our beloved star. Others wondered if it was truly the end of the Selleck era. And the thing is, Tom himself did nothing to clear any of these rumors up. Even when fans questioned the tabloids for saying stuff about his health without providing any evidence, Selleck remained silent. This, paired up with the fact that he was seen walking with a slight limp on Blue Bloods, only made fans worry more. Then, Globe magazine took it up a notch in March 2021. Throwing a curveball into the mix, they claimed that Selleck's limping was due to him piling on a whopping 100 pounds. From action hero to heavyweight contender, the rumors just keep getting wilder. Still, Selleck remained silent. Even in his 2019 memoir, Tom conveniently skipped any mention of these alleged incurable health conditions. Sure, the rumors hadn't gotten so crazy back then, but it still made fans wonder what was actually going on behind closed doors. Though some people think these rumors should finally be put to rest, as Selix appeared in all seasons of the series Blue Bloods, since the news about his health started circulating. And he's looked perfectly normal doing so. I mean, since this whole Tom Selleck is dying fiasco started in 2019, there's been four new seasons of Blue Bloods. That means more than 70 different episodes. And since Selleck plays the main character, Commissioner Frank Reagan, he's been in all of them. If he was dealing with stuff like arthritis, near blindness, back pain, and some mysterious incurable illness, don't you think he would have called it a day by now? And yeah, sure, Selleck might not be the same mustache-twirling macho man he used to be back in the 80s, but the guy's still doing pretty good for himself. Like, some Blue Bloods fans are just finding out that Tom is in his late 70s, and who can blame them? The man doesn't look a day over 60. And while some actors may resort to mystical potions or secret deals with supernatural beings to maintain their youthful appearance, Selleck seems to have cracked the code on his own. So, what's his secret, you ask? Well, let me enlighten you. The man stays active by tending to his sprawling 65-acre ranch in sunny California. This isn't your average backyard garden, my friends. Selleck has rolled up his sleeves and taken on the task of planting trees. In his own words, he proudly admits, I've probably planted a thousand trees myself. Talk about getting your hands dirty. But that's not all. Selleck's fitness regimen veers far away from the monotonous routines of a typical gym goer. He shuns the dull treadmill and weight machines, opting instead for the hard work on his ranch. Clearing brush, tackling grunt work, and nurturing the land has become his exercises of choice. It's a refreshing departure from the conventional fitness grind, and it's clearly paying off in spades. 
In an interview with People magazine, Selleck credits his relationships and his beloved ranch as the anchors that keep him grounded in this crazy world. The Ventura, California ranch, lovingly dubbed his personal retreat, serves as a sanctuary for the actor, a haven where he can find solace amidst the chaos of showbiz. It's his slice of heaven on earth, a place where he can escape the glitz and glamour and simply be at one with nature. But let's not forget the other activities that have kept this man forever young. Selleck has dabbled in beach volleyball, taken part in competitive softball, and had a genuine love affair with baseball. Golf, on the other hand, was never his cup of tea. Sure, he played it, but not for the love of the sport itself. Nope, he did it to spend precious moments with his dear old dad. And here's a revelation that will leave you gasping. Tom Selleck has never dyed his hair. Yes, you heard it right. That luscious salt and pepper mane is all natural. He embraces the graying process with open arms, considering it a blessing that softens the blows that time may bring. It's honestly a refreshing attitude in an industry obsessed with maintaining an eternal facade of youth. So kudos to him. And since he's in such great health, there shouldn't be any doubts that he'll be returning to Blue Bloods for a 14th season. But there were. Okay, let's start with the shocker that had fans clutching their pearls. When the CBS renewal list was announced back in February 2023, Blue Bloods was nowhere to be found. The show that had us all on the edge of our seats with its thrilling cop stories suddenly disappeared from the radar. Cue the collective gasp from loyal fans who were left wondering if their favorite characters were about to be mercilessly ripped away from their lives. But just when we thought all hope was lost, Deadline revealed that the show was coming back for a 14th season. The network probably realized they couldn't mess with the hardcore fans who live and breathe for their weekly dose of Reagan family drama. And it turns out, the cast members, including Selleck, Donnie Wahlberg, Bridget Moynihan, and Will Estes, all played a big part in getting the show renewed. According to reports, they were willing to do whatever it took to keep the show alive. And by whatever it took, I mean they agreed to take a massive 25% pay cut. Whoa, talk about putting your money where your mouth is. These talented actors weren't about to let a little thing like money stand in the way of bringing joy to millions of fans around the world. Now that's what I call dedication, folks. But wait, there's more. In a jaw-dropping interview with TV Insider last year, the ever-charismatic Selleck revealed that when his co-star Bridget Moynihan expressed her wish for Blue Bloods to hit an incredible 15 seasons, he didn't shy away from the challenge. Oh no, he boldly announced that he was game to come back for more. So not only is Selleck coming back for season 14, but he's confident that he can keep going for another year. How's that for all those health doubters, huh? Now, let's fast forward to the burning question on everyone's minds. When will we get our next fix of Blue Bloods? Ah, uh, my friends, that's where the mystery deepens. We're still in the dark there. And let me tell you, the diehards are desperately waiting for details about the production and premiere dates. CBS, you hearing this? We need answers and we need them now. But fear not, because one thing's for sure, when Blue Bloods does finally return for its 14th season, it's bound to be an explosive roller coaster ride of emotions. So, from questions about the future of Blue Bloods to rumors that the actors contracted an incurable disease, that's why Tom Selleck fans are scared.